Hello all. So let's continue the next part of this tutorial. So let's get started. So as you can see over here, we have uh, started with the detailing of this element over here. So let's continue that part over here. Let's scale a bit. So now what we'll be doing is like, we'll be just pushing this a bit down over here on top of it and we'll be just creating this stuff over here so for that let's take a cylinder over here so after taking a cylinder let's just push that out over here so increase its sides reduces stuff and what we'll be doing now over here is like we we'll just scale it and increase the cap segments over here so after that convert to editable poly press 4 over here select all this polygons over here and let's just extrude this out so once you extrude this out let's go into this side view over here and let's and let's adjust this stuff accordingly that's it all right so select this select this just ring it press control and click on this polygons make sure you include this include this all select this and give bevel over here so let's go over here and click ok and just scale it and just push it inside so you can just select this edges over here and you can just give a bit of chamfer to it click ok so scale this more bigger and just duplicate it down so again select this and just give a color to it so once you are done over here so now what we will be doing over here is like so we will be creating this back part over here So if you look over here, so let's go into this side view over here and let's take a line over here, let's take a 
line over here so go into rendering or else you can go into this and give a sweep modifier much better so so just reduce its length and width over here so still you need to uh, reduce its thickness so just push this over here and uh, mirror it in x axis that's it so again go into this side view and definitely you can just take okay so go to the top view again then let's take a line over here and just push this line up over here and give again a sweep modifier so just 0 0.399 0 0.966 and 0 0.13 so we can just go with this values over here and just push it over here on the top so once you are done over here so for now we need to create this kind of stairs over here so let's again go to the side view over here take a line over here and just drag it in this way so drag this over here enable in viewport make it rectangular make it more thinner so make a copy of it over here in this way so now save your file again take a line over here So scale this so just drag it So once you're done with this, you can just give a color to it. So if you uh, look at it over here, so we need to make it a bit thicker. Let's make it 
more thicker all right and So just push this down more. So push this down more. And let's take again a box over here. So that box will definitely will be over here. Select this, scale it, convert to editable poly. and press R and scale it all right so go on to the top over here let's take again a cylinder over here So, so just push this over here. And reduce its height. And uh, reduce its cap segments. That's it. Alright. So, we are done with this. So you can just duplicate this so that's your work is done over here So thanks for watching this tutorial.